Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another video brought to you by CockroachZone.com. As the title suggests, today we'll be briefly discussing the topic of cockroaches, and if you or someone else can bring them home, as in a roach hitching a ride on you or your belongings and coming into your house to wreak havoc. Before we get started, let's take a look at this topic overview. People can bring cockroaches into your house by accident. Roaches in their egg sacs will hide on clothes baggage, and even cardboard boxes. Here, they avoid detection and spread their infestation even further. Though it's not the most common way for roaches to jump from home to home, it does happen. Indeed, the idea of guests bringing unwanted vermin in might put you off inviting anyone over ever again. Now, that's a bit harsh, but I guess it could be true. While the notion of bringing an entire roach or roaches home is extremely rare, it is possible for a roach to, here again, hitch a ride on your belongings, as we noted, especially if you've placed your things on the floor for the most of the visit. Handbags and purses are the most vulnerable, as would be expected. In terms of the concern, the biggest issue would obviously be eggs. While a single roach is gross, it's not really all that much of a major concern for alarm. However, it's certainly important to get rid of it as soon as possible before it's able to produce new roaches within your home. Now that we've covered the foundation for this topic, let's take a closer look. While visitors can bring roaches, it's all about where they've been, as in where those people have been. Do they have an infestation? Did they stop by someone else's residence before coming over to your place? While it's easy to wonder if roaches can come home with you, it's also important to address whether guests can bring roaches to your home. While this home-to-home -home type of transportation is incredibly rare, and yeah, it's a bit it's a bit humorous if we're being honest. It can happen. I think it's fair to say that at least once in our lives, we've gone to slip our foot in our house shoes, for example, and found an unwanted guest. Not necessarily a cockroach, but some type of critter in the night. Have you ever gone to your garage and moved a bag or some type of other belonging with pockets or little dark hidden cupboard areas? And yeah, you found something unsavory? Yeah, I think it's happened to most of us. It's along these lines that it's not out of the realm of the possibility that roaches could hitch a ride with it someone's personal effects and indeed enter your home. While the literal home-to-home -home transfer is extremely rare, as we've noted, as in a roach clinging onto the <laughs> guest or, you know, personal effects or whatever, but home-to-home -home transfer can happen in, interestingly enough, an apartment complex setting. Not your guest to your residence transfer, but an actual apartment to apartment transfer. If your neighbor, for example, has a roach infestation, it's possible for roaches to navigate through your walls or through their walls and end up in the other person's living space. Well, this is certainly not a pleasant thought. It can indeed happen. In fact, this is far more likely to transpire than the other issues that we've noted within this video. Looking at today's core topic or whether or not roaches can come to your home and or if guests can bring them over to your place, just pay close attention to items. That's really all it boils down to. Is someone bringing over a box from their closet or garage? Perhaps something that hasn't really been opened in years? An old storage box, for example? If so, those are the items you need to examine. Roaches will hide away in boxes. Have you ever opened some old storage box or a shoe box in your garage and found dead roaches? Yeah, not a pretty visual. There's a better chance of roaches being transported to your home via old boxes and carrying cases than, say, hitching a ride on your best friend's Air Jordans. At any rate, just be mindful. While the odds are certainly, and obviously, very slim of any of this taking place, just always make sure that your home is clean and well inspected. This will allow you to put an end to any potential roach problem long before it actually ever truly begins. And on that note, that will close things out for the video portion of this material. But if you'd like to know more about this topic, please be sure to visit us at CockroachZone.com. There you'll find a full-length article dedicated to this very subject matter. Are you currently watching us off-site? If so, please click the initial link in the description box below. Said link will take you to all of the valuable information. And until our paths cross again, and I certainly hope they do, we'd like to thank you once again for joining us today. Please have a wonderful day. All the best to you and yours, and we will talk to you later.